Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Cross. I don't know what part we're on. I think um uh 60? I don't know. Something like that. Um yeah, we recruited Van. Sorry about like that I made it so fast at the end. I was just like, Ugh, let's get out of here. So um, there's one more character I want to recruit, but we kind of have to go this way anyway. And the best thing to do before we go on is talk to this dude right here. Can it be you, Sir Lynx? You are safe, sir? Where have you been all this time? We've set up a temporary military dock beyond this point. Nobody may pass without permission from Commander Norris. Not even you, Sir Lynx. Commander Norris is at the ruins of Viper Manor. Please report to your current status to him immediately. I can talk. So, in case you don't know, they I don't know if they mentioned him before, Norris is the um, leader of uh, one of the poor armies. He leads the Black Wind. And, uh, yeah, so let's go talk to him. Sometimes if you don't talk to that guy and you come up to the manor, they won't let you in. So if you do go to the manor and they don't let you in, you probably just forgot to talk to that dude in Termina. So, just showing that so you guys know what to do. So It's random. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Hello. See, they'll block you if you if you didn't talk to him. The basement. Hey, this place looks a little uh, run down. We've actually never been here in this world. Anyway, I just wanted to thank everybody because I looked on my page today and realized that I have over 400 subscribers. Thank you so much, you guys. You have no idea what it means to me. Like, I appreciate each and every one of you. Can't believe that you all really wanted to subscribe to me and watch because clearly I still don't know what I'm doing but thank you so 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 much I really 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 appreciate it you guys rock um, Radius is going to tell us a little bit about himself and Dario is dead the general and the others are missing and yeah the manor looks a little bad <laughs> Not too bad, just a little. He discovered nothing on his investigation. All he knows is that a man named Lynx approached the general and has involved him in some kind of incident. The only difference with the other world you talk about is that something has happened to the general three years ago. Okay, I'm with it so far. I just hope this Norris fellow knows something. Well, let's find out. I know nothing. I was not involved with the plan. Nobody was suspecting you. You got a guilty conscience or what? I do not find it amusing. Well, nobody really asked you, but whatever. You can't get through the normal way, obviously. It's all broken down. So what you need to do... You can't visit the dragon stable at this point. See, this is as far as you can go. So everything else is cut off. Right down here, if you talk to this dude, you enter through this hut, which I guess is ends up being a well, even though it kind of looks like a little shack or something. But yes come down here and if you look you actually end up you can go through the shadow force to get here if you recognize where we are you just keep going through that tunnel it's hard to get up here oh no it's just hard for me because I'm retarded <laughs> you know me and walking into things I don't think there's anything in here as far as enemies pretty sure there's not for some reason I'm having a hard time remembering this place oh wait now I do there's like this waterway that you have to go through and there isn't um, any enemies to speak of but we will come back here later and do a few things because we can't do some of the things now because that guard is in the way but I will show you what we can do come on over here and it's tricky because you can't tell but if you come back here that's how you get this mithril helmet I'll take that thank you very much um well, wait do I need it you know what? I don't need it. Let's give it to, uh... Madam misses a lot here. Probably help her out a little bit. Wait, can she not wear it? Am I missing something? <laughs> Famous last words. Oh, here they are. Oh, you know what? No. We just didn't go down far enough. Alright. Okay, so... Right here. Push this barrel into the water. And it floats. And it gets stuck right here. This is how you get by. But wait. 
We need one more. Where could the other one be? Well, the other one is where the dude is standing, I believe. So, can't do that right now. I believe that's what we have to wait for. I think when you come back at a later time, he's not there. You push it and you watch it go all the way this way and it falls. But right now, we just have to go up this way. So we're good. So no worries. I hope I remember this part. I really, for some reason, I just don't. You can't go up this way. But we couldn't enter the jail before, if you remember. So now we're finally here. We can't get this yet, so don't worry about it. And he will be in here. Sir Lynx, it has been a while, sir. As you can see, the manor is in shambles. There is still no sign of the general or the others. We are still investigating the area, but it appears that the frozen flame is not here. Sir, are you really Sir Lynx? Oh, you're a sharp one, ain't you? You seem different than I last remember. How did Radius get here so fast? You are correct. This man is not Lynx. Excuse me, sir, but who might you be? I am Radius, a dragoon. Although I have been retired for four years. <laughs> it's just me, or does it look like he's been retired for like 40? So you're Radius? One of the former Devas? Divas? Devas? Devas? We never figured that out, did we? It's an honor to meet you, sir. I believe you, sir, but it is still hard to accept that this man is not Sir Lynx. He may look like Lynx, but his spirit is of another. That is quite strange, if I may say so. It is up to you what you want to believe. So, what business did you have with Lynx? Have you uncovered anything about the disappearance of the general? You'll be doing us a great favor by telling us what you know. Very well. I will tell you what I know. Well, that was easy. People are trusting around here, aren't they? It was actually Sir Lynx who approached us about the existence of the frozen flame in El Nido. This is good music, too. Being from the main continent, we had doubted its very existence, so I was sent to El Nido. Oh, God. I'm not saying that word. As a spy. <laughs> not gonna ruin it. I had narrowed down the location to Viper Manor, but it appeared as though General Viper and his men were in search of it as well. Eventually, I was called back to Poor, but it was then that I heard General Viper and his men had disappeared, and that the manor had been destroyed as such. I heard only recently that there is good evidence the General and his men headed to the Dead Sea. The Dead Sea is an ocean located to the east, surrounded by coral. It used to be called the Sea of Eden, but even then, not many dared enter. We investigated the area, but to no avail. We could find no entrance. So more talk of the Dead Sea. Looks like that's where we're going to be headed to eventually. It is you, Sir Lynx, who wish to change this distorted world using the frozen flame. It is? Oh, we're learning a little bit now about Lynx's motive. Ooh la la! Such grand dreams, Monsieur Lynx! Hold your tongue. That's right. So, the Dead Sea. Everything's pointing to that, I guess. The ocean was called the Sea of Eden until three years ago. This may just be the clue we're looking for. Once we uncover Lynx's plans, it should be easy enough to counter them. Are you planning to go to the Dead Sea? There is no way to get in there. We searched all over for an entrance, but to no avail. No one knows anything about it, either. Yes, I doubt you'll be able to get in. I'm sure the demi-humans of Marbule know something about this, but they detest humans. Especially those from the main continent. Perhaps they would give us a hint if we were to go, since we're not really human anymore, are we? Then may I join you, sir? I want to know. I want to know if the frozen flame really exists, and about everything that has happened here. What about you? Hm? Moi? But of course, I will follow this, Monsieur Lynx. The other one is no longer Monsieur Lynx. Nobody asked Sprig her opinion, but that's okay. <laughs> There's a reason. There's a military boat docked in Termina. Let us use that. And Norris enlisted. Here's the deal with Norris. I really like him. He's... There's gonna be, like, pros and cons about this dude. I love him, so we're gonna take him for a little while in a bit. I forgot to take everything off Sprig like an ass, so I'll do that later. So right now we'll stay like this. But, um... 
he's really really super good to me I think not only is he like hot as hell but he uses a um a pistol a revolver he's like one of the only ones that will you'll see using the gun and it's really really super cool so I do enjoy him <laughs> take that as you want so um all right so we got a boat now which is good and we actually got to go because I'm running out of time so where are we gonna do <laughs> This is the boat that we get. Not this one all the way over here, which I originally thought. And I was like, oh my god, look at this thing. No. Nope, this is our boat. <laughs> You're going to have to learn to love it. When we come back, we will um, bring Norris with. And I'm going to show you a few little optional things that we're going to do. We're actually going to go recruit some more characters really fast before we move on. So see you later, guys. Thanks for joining me. Bye.